Hello, welcome to the Chidi Moya Barbershop. My name is Pine, and I will be your hairdresser and or barber for today. How can I help you? Alright, you want a cut, shave, and dye. Uh, may I ask what color you want dyed? Alright, we can do that for you. So, um, can I touch your hair? Hmm, yes, um, well, by taking a look at your hair, you kind of have like a 2012 hipster look going on But yes, it's quite long, your beard is quite long as well, so you want, uh, any type of styling? Do you need, like, any sort of guidance on how you want it styled? You can tell me what you want and I can do it for you. Hmm, okay. Okay. Well, sit down. Sit down. I will put a towel on for you. Let me just take this. There you go. This should be fine. Alright, now, um, here is quite long and dry. So I will have to start by cutting it. Yes? How long do you want it trimmed? Do you want it... Yeah, to about your chin? Alright. Well, that would be a little bit. So I will um, trim it with this comb. Okay, let me just brush it out. You have very nice straight hair. Hmm? Do you have a hair care routine? Hmm, I can tell. It looks very luscious and soft. Just giving it a quick brush through to get any kind of tangles or not. Okay. Well, I think that is all the knots. So let me get my scissors. I have these scissors here. Oh, I'm not cutting, I'm just demonstrating how the scissors work. <laughs> Don't worry. So I will go in with this, with my scissors, and with the brush, and we'll just comb out, and then cut. I should not switch hands. <laughs> this is my dominant hand. I don't think I can cut with my non-dominant hand. Okay. It should all be around an even length now. I'm just gonna go in with a little bit of, um, you know, feathering the edges a bit, so it looks a bit more natural instead of just a straight cut. Mm -hmm. All right, we just.
uh, do you like your, your cut? <laughs> like, would you like me to cut it more? I can't really make it grow up more, so I'm sorry if I cut it too short, but I did try my best to cut it to where you wanted it. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, I'm glad you like it, so, um, well, I cut your hair. Oh, I need to trim your beard as well. Give me a second, your beard is, you know, it's growing out quite long, so let me just go in and Wait, let me actually get this brush. Yes, let me uh, get this small brush and try to just... Anyways, while I trim your beard, how are you doing today? Mm -hmm. You're doing good? Yeah, is the family okay? <laughs> How are the kids? Mm, well, I'm glad everything's alright at home. Mm. Yes. And you paid for this in advance, right? You paid for this appointment before booking it? Oh, you're just a walk-in appointment. Well, that's fine. You just have to go and talk to the, you know, the front desk and pay them after you're done, okay? Okay. Okay. I think that is... Let me get your mustache real quick, just... Okay. I think that is your beard and mustache. Done. It's all nice. And, well, it's not short. I still need to clean up around your neck. So, I'm gonna do that with a nice, you know, shave with this razor. But, before I start that, let me get my shaving gel ready. So, I have this... Sensitive shaving gel. Mm. Yes, yes, you just want me to trim your beard. Yes, so like, uh, I'll shave up here along this area and then along your jawline to give you a more um, streamlined beard, as well as your neck and, you know, some do some trimming of your eyebrows as well. Mm. Don't worry, I'm not gonna chop your beard off if that's what you're worried about. most useful if we used the right kind of hair for these for, I mean, sorry it would be the least painful to the company if we like, used non-sensitive skin products and accidentally got a lawsuit so I'm just gonna spray it here it's very quiet and we're gonna take this brush I have here we're gonna mix it up Okay. 
massage your neck a little bit okay perfect okay so now I'm going to go in with this razor and I'm going to just you know gently shave off everything that you don't want to try to clean up your beard a bit, so let me just Okay, um, can you lift up your head for me a bit? I'm gonna get me under the chin and Adam's up. Okay, perfect. Great. Uh, close your eyes. I'm gonna get this area now. to move on to your hair time. Yes, I do need to hurry up a bit as well, you arrived a bit late for your appointment, so um, yes, I can tell that my nine o'clock is sitting right there waiting, so let's hurry it up a bit, shall we? <laughs> right, let me put everything away. So, this is the hair dye I will use, very preferred color. Lucky for you, I have prepared it beforehand, and I will just... Why am I not acting, adding the color to it? Well, this is a hair dye that we make specifically at the Chiyomori Barber Shop. It is made with all natural products. Yes, all natural products. And here we, we have this hair product designed... Um, specifically to dye your hair, but the cool thing about it is that your hair will change to the color that you wish. But I mean, when I apply it to your hair, your hair will just already change to the color, so there's no need to add anything to it. It's like, it's cool, it's pretty cool. this color anyways yeah so it's fine 
There's nothing to worry about. So I have a small section that I have sectioned off and then we'll start dyeing so let me uncap my hair dye. falling out. So I'll just... Oh my god. It went everywhere. Well, I'm just bringing it into the hole like this. It's a bit loose, but that's fine. What we're gonna do is I'm gonna take this hair dye brush. Hair dye brush. Mm. Yeah, since this hair dye is made of all natural products, it actually smells really nice. It has no ammonia in it. Unlike, you know, traditional hair dye. Here, smell. Mmm. Smells very good, yes. Okay, so I'm just going to take this. Just mix it up. This is the whole bottle, which is fine. Do need a lot of no. product. Okay, so I will actually unclip this section and put it here, and I will take this. 
section and clip it up so we work on the next section so again I'm gonna just stir up your hair dye Two more sections to go because you know, yeah, your hair is quite short. So, why are you dyeing your hair? Do you just want, you know, a change of look? Someone tell you that you'd suit this color? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Oh, you want to impress someone? Well, I don't know if dyeing your hair is the best idea for that, but well, hair dye does fade off after a while. I hope you don't regret this. Let me just go once more and just go through all the fruits since your whole head is dyed. Let me just actually add it on the tips. You know, pick up your whole head of hair like this. Do all the fruit down here. Part your hair here. I need a brush. I'll use this brush. Well, that's good. Now I'm going to go in with your beard. So for your beard, I'm actually going to use this smaller hair dye brush.
that's it. You don't have much beard left, but it should be okay. Yes, it's okay for me to get my hands dirty. It's fine. It's just hair dye. It's not gonna hurt me. Right. But on that, let me just actually let me get some here in my hands and just go. Just try and massage some into your beard. There you go. Perfect. Well, now you look like a... Well, you still look like a 2012 hipster, but less messy, which is good. Yes. So, what you're going to do now is you are going to go home and you're going to wash your hair dye out. Yeah, unfortunately, I... I am running late, so I can't wash your hair out for you, but that's fine. I'll, I'll tell the receptionist to reduce the hair washing out of the bride, out of the total fees, and just go home and wash your hair. You'll be fine. You'll survive the car ride home. How far away is your house? Okay, well, that is far enough that it won't hurt you. Don't worry. Alright, well, thank you so much for coming to the Chinimoya Hair Dressers and Barbers. My name is Pine, and... Thank you so much for coming, and I hope you have a lovely, lovely day or night. Bye-bye!